Yeah, so I'm filling you guys up. I'm filling up the water. I'm gonna be sticking this GoPro in there. And uh, yes, that's what we're gonna do right now. I got a little floaty thing on it. One of my, uh, I don't know if it's a stabilizer. I'm kinda confused if it's a stabilizer or a floaty. But it's one of the two. But uh, yeah, I'm about to put it under the water. Oh, here. I would say, eh, it's cool. It's not super high. We'll get it warm. We'll put it under there. That's what I'm trying to do. So, yeah. Um, hope you guys do enjoy. Here's my phone. I got a new phone. But, we're recording for 40 seconds. I think that, I mean, it's enough water. It's just, I don't know how it's going to work. I want to make sure everything's closed. In my hero session, everything's closed, everything's fine. So let's go ahead and stick this under. Now, I will say, it's... So yeah, let's do it right now. I want to take this and sit it. How's this thing looking? Looks good. I think we can fill it up with some little water, so we're going to do that, um, where the heck, okay, I guess I'll be using this. And I have to switch over from just to be too much of a big deal, but, um, yeah, we're going to stick it back to this little area of pool of water again, so let's go ahead and do that. Here's my phone, by the way, what I'm looking at. Let's go ahead. Make sure everything's closed. Everything's fine. Closed. And we have to one lens first. There we go. That's on the water. We need to test one more thing. Have this going. Can't survive. Well, uh, for the true test, it really can survive. This GoPro really can survive going under the water for a short period of time. I don't know how long you can actually keep it under the water for, but I know you can. Hope you guys enjoyed. Smack that like button. See you guys next time.